ISIL in Afghanistan says it carried out a suicide bombing at a Shia mosque in Kunduz province, which killed at least 60 people. Also in the country, a million children at risk of dying from severe malnutrition. The United Nations warns there are just weeks left to prevent a humanitarian catastrophe. Hello, I'm Marianne Namazio, watching Al Jazeera live from London, also coming up on the programme. Marking Brazil's tragic COVID record, 600 white flags to honour more than 600,000 deaths. The battle is worth it. The personal sacrifices are worth it. And journalists Maria Ressa and Dmitry Muratov win the Nobel Peace Prize for fighting for freedom of expression in the Philippines and Russia. Hello and welcome to the programme. At least 60 people have been killed in northern Afghanistan in the deadliest attack since foreign forces withdrew from the country at the end of August. A suicide bomber targeted Friday prayers at a Shia mosque in Kunduz, close to the border with Tajikistan. Hundreds were injured in the attack.